This is Joy of Heaven, Saint of the Day for July 25th. As we celebrate the Feast of Saint James the Greater's Day. Saint James the Greater was one of Jesus's first disciples. He died in 44 AD. He gave up his life for the faith as a martyr. Saint James the Greater did a lot to spread Christianity throughout Spain. Though little is known about the early life of St. James the Greater, it is known that he was a son of Zebedee, and that Salome was his mother. James the Greater was also the brother of St. John the Evangelist, most likely the older brother. It is also known that James was a Galilean. He was known to be of an energetic and vehement temper. He and St. John were called, Sons of Thunder, because of this impetuous character. The title, The Greater, is attributed to St. James to distinguish him from another of Jesus' disciples, who is called St. James the Less. It is commonly thought that St. James the Greater was taller than St. James the Less. According to scripture, James was a fisherman. He was with his father and his brother, St. John, when Jesus caused Simon Peter to catch a miraculous large catch of fish. Then, Jesus called James, along with Peter and John, to be his disciples. James is mentioned again in scripture on the occasion of Jesus' transfiguration. James was one of three apostles to witness Jesus' transfiguration. James was also one of three apostles to witness Jesus raising Jairus' daughter. Scripture also says that James and his brother John were full of indignation at a Samaritan town that refused to receive Jesus. James and John wanted to call down fire on that town, but Jesus rebuked them. The mother of saints James and John is also mentioned in scripture as requesting that her two sons sit on either side of Jesus when he should come into his kingdom. The Gospel of Mark indicates that they shared their mother's ambition for themselves, and that they still did not understand the spiritual character of Jesus' mission. When Jesus asks James and John if they are ready to drink the chalice that he drinks, they say that they are ready. After Jesus' death, resurrection, and ascension, James preached and conducted missionary work in Israel and the Roman Empire. Then, he traveled to Spain and worked to spread the gospel there for almost 40 years. Tradition says that the Blessed Virgin Mary appeared to James one day while he was praying. She asked him to build a church in her honor, and he did so. James later went back to Jerusalem. There, King Herod had him beheaded on account of James' Christian faith. In the year 44 AD James was the first apostle to be martyred. James' followers were forbidden from burying his body after his martyrdom, so they brought his remains to Compostela, Spain. They buried him there. During the 9th century, St. James' remains were transferred to a tomb in Santiago de Compostela. His remains are currently in the Cathedral of Santiago. St. James the Greater is the patron saint of many places, including Spain, Guatemala, Nicaragua, Philippines, Badian, Pampanga, Sogod, and Cebu. You can seek his intercession if you live in one of these places or are planning to visit one of these places. You can also ask him to pray for someone you know who lives in one of these places. Additionally, Saint James the Greater is the patron saint of furriers, veterinarians, tanners, oyster fishers, woodcarvers, and pharmacists. You can ask him to pray for you if you work in one of these professions. Thank you.